In this tutorial, we will show you some new features of Microsoft Excel 2013. First of all, Excel 2013 comes with a wide variety of templates. Once you open Excel, a number of templates are shown to you and you can scroll down to see more or even search online by typing in the search bar which is on the top left side of the page. Excel 2013 comes with a built-in tour guide which tells about the new features. Click on the Welcome to Excel thumbnail and an Excel sheet will open. A handy feature that Excel 2013 offers is the Flash Fill option. This feature recognizes your data patterns and is able to predict and enter relevant data in the blank cells. Over here we have a list of email addresses which includes first names followed by their last names. As soon as you are done filling in the first two cells, Excel predicts the rest and shows you how the rest of the blanks will be filled in by the Flash Fill feature. To fill the rest of the blank cells, press the Enter button. In order to save time, Excel came up with a feature called Quick Analysis. In the next sheet, we have a table. Select the table and the Quick Analysis button will appear on the bottom right side of the table. Click on it and a box will appear showing you options which can be applied to the chart. These options include formatting, charts, totals, tables, and spark lines. When you hover over these options, you will be able to see the preview for them. Another new feature is the Recommended Charts feature. Through this feature, Excel shows you the logical options which will describe your data in the best manner in form of graphical representation. In order to see how the new feature works, we will go to the next sheet, select the table, and click on the Recommended Charts button located in the Insert tab. Once you have clicked on the button, the Insert Chart box appears with a list of recommended charts. You can also view the rest of the options by going to the All Charts tab. Once the chart has been added, three buttons will appear on the top right corner of the chart. The top button will allow you to add or remove chart elements. Through the middle button, you will be able to change the graph's style and color. The bottom button deals with the filters added to the chart. You can add or remove categories and series using this option. 